Hi everyone, this is Louise from 805 Soap. Um, I'm just showing you some of my new soaps. Um, this one here is called My Garden. And this soap is made with jasmine and um, sage. And it's got some floral scents in it. It's got an all natural color made with turmeric. That's what it was colored with. And I stamped it also. And I'm going to show you how I made my homemade stamp. Uh, on that, but um, it's it turned out really nice uh, And I also split the colors This color right here is is colored with the turmeric and it's got candela infused oils With candela and rose petals in there and the other side is just plain So um, I'm really happy how the way they turned out and I also stamped them if you can see on here I stamped them with 805 because that's the name of my company so um and I made that stamp, and I'll show you guys in a minute about how I made my stamp. Um, these are some of my Mountain Pour soaps. These are for my grandson, Michael. And um, he, uh, he loves to have soaps in the bathtub. And I just experimented here with some Mountain Pour. And this is a, uh, a funnel pour. So this really turned out fun. This was really fun to do. And I'm going to probably end up doing a video on how to do this. But uh, I really enjoyed this one. But anyways, let me show you how I made this stamp. I went to Michael's. And Michael's carries these stick-on their stick-on uh, lettering for stamping. My daughter does stamping. And they just peel right off. If I can peel it off. Hold on. Oh, it's really on there. They've got some really good glue on here. And they just peel off. They're clear. <clears throat> and what I did was I took one of her stamps. And this is just a stamp that, that she had. And I adhered these plastic stamps on here. So I just used the back of it. Because I didn't have a piece of wood. So then what I did was I took this stamp. And I stamped my soaps. So that was a homemade stamp, and I'm really liking it a lot. So um, if anybody's interested in making a homemade stamp, you can get these letters at Michael's or probably any craft store. And they're sold in the scrapbooking section. And they're, I don't know, a couple of dollars for them. They have all different letter types and script or if you want them plain, bold. So you can buy those and then put your, your name on, on a stamp that's already there and use this as the base. So that was fun to do today and I just thought I'd share that with you because um, you can make these at home if you'd like. And uh, I think it turned out really well if you can see it on my soaps. Um, so, but anyways, um, have a great Memorial Day weekend. I'll talk to you ladies soon. Bye.